all right <laughs> i just hit stop and then i hit play again let's do a no ums video it's sort of a no ums video where i'm saying i hit a wall i hit a wall because it's been probably a couple of weeks since i've done a proper no ums video and the last video i just did there was the first time i've actually kind of tackled rudenberg's uh text and in some ways it was like oh fuck i have like i i have on my calendar here do a noams video but it's like i have nothing to say i didn't haven't done anything so i decided i would just open up the book to where i'm blocked and talk my way through it and do exercises that way um we've definitely opened things up it was it was like the warm-up exercises and a lot of that stuff I you can see kind of doing alone or you can see just doing like, oh, okay, I have 10 minutes. I'm just going to quickly do this and it's not going to take a lot of mental and physical and emotional energy. But I think there's something about these exercises where you're going to, you have to kind of generate sort of material for yourself, whether you're doing a description, which is I kind of half-assedly did, or uh, telling an telling a story from your life which i kind of half-assedly did is one thing uh and then we're getting into like constructing a full myth story i mean maybe you'd have to see that in action maybe it could be something as uh simple simple as uh you know uh brave brave knights were sitting around a table and uh having eating and drinking and celebrating um their brotherhood when suddenly a woman bursts into the room, an old woman, and she shouts at them and she curses them for being, for being complacent, for being lazy, for only caring about themselves. And the, 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 the leader of them, uh, Heinrich, stands up and says, like, you know, how dare you? How dare you come in to our hall and insult us thusly? And... The, the he's he is an imposing large man and he and most people cower before him but this old woman uh did not back down a jot and charges with them that while they sit and drink in this hall uh outside a terrible monster is preying on all their people and this monster uh this very night has taken her daughter and why are you not out there protecting us? Why are you in here drinking and carousing and um, being lazy assholes? Uh, and to Heinrich's, Heinrich, Heinrich actually just curses back at her and goes to smack her. But at this point, a young knight, Brent, stands up and interposes himself between the two and says... No, I will. This 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 old, old woman has had this old woman has a righteous cause here, and I will go, and I will go and seek this this monster, and I will uh, find out what the fate of her daughter is. And Heinrich kind of pulled up short and feels maybe a little bit dishonored, but he's like, "Yeah, go ahead, do whatever you're going to do, but we're not we're not going to waste our time." on this old woman and her supposed daughter who's probably just taken up with somebody and hasn't didn't 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 uh didn't feel like telling her mother didn't to feel like telling her mother of her shame for out uh rooting around um with some some burly farmhand uh so brent and the old woman leave the hall and the old woman leads him um through a path uh to into the middle of the forest where the old woman lives with her daughter and the old woman points down a, 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 a pathway where the trees on either side are broken or buckled, bashed down. Like they've been, like, it's like something gigantic has come through and knocked down all these trees. And he says, and he's, he's, he kind of gulps and he's like, Oh boy, there's something going on here. And he half thinks maybe I should go back to the hall and try and get some of, uh, the other knights to follow him but then he he decides no i'm the one who has has taken on this task i'm the one who is gonna who will who who will see it through he tells the old woman to go into the hut 
and that uh, by morning he swears that he will either come back with her with her daughter or at least the very at the very least news of what happened to her daughter and this this monster's head and thus begins the story i'm not going to do the whole story because yeah it's just like this would just take forever and ever and ever so that kind of that is i think the level of language and storytelling that rudenberg is demanding from uh her her students students who are supposed to be telling these stories in front of an audience uh as well so you can kind of gauge are you losing people's um attentions attention and stuff like that attention which i don't have and i don't plan to have i'm not starting an acting troupe um but i guess that said if i can set myself uh, self aside a single day to just open the book and to do that and then to read a little bit ahead and then do it again Maybe I can get through these sections. Um, I'm just going to give myself permission of like, this isn't going to be, oh, I'm going to find set things to do. I'm just going to get through the book. I'm going to get through the book and, and explore it. It's definitely, oh, wow. Because I've been very tired with a lot of rolling my eyes about with Rodenberg, having a lot of opining about what's wrong with um, society today kind of stuff, which, you know, she might be perfectly correct about, but... It's not what I'm looking for in a book is is this um, elder respected lady's opinions on what's wrong with society and how we communicate with. I don't know. I was looking for more practical stuff versus editorial. And there's a lot of editorial uh, in the book. Now, actually, to be fair, we've definitely gotten into the chunky part of the book where these are exercises, which it kind of started off with a little warm up exercise and is now got into heavy but feels like fairly heavy work to me. It's like, this is exhausting. This is the kind of stuff where you say, yeah, being an actor is not easy. Speaking, uh, speaking to an audience or even speaking to a camera is a physical activity and it can be emotionally draining as much as a physically draining activity. So yes, my commitment for the next week coming up is to do a little bit of reading ahead and then just do another video like this where it's like, okay, this is the exercise and I'll just do the exercise on camera and do it that way. And I probably am not going to do it more than once to be fair, to be, to be honest, I'm not going to do it more than once. It's exhausting. Um, yeah. Yeah. Unless I, I start going, okay, I'm going to tell, I'm going to make, make a couple of notes and try and tell a story uh in a video like 10 minutes of storytelling today jay maybe that that we'll see we'll see what develops out of this at the moment i'm just going to go through it that might be that strangely after i said that it's like oh that would be kind of interesting just storytelling video would be an interesting video to, to do each day whether it's fiction or non-fiction of just here's the story and see if i can get good at that because to be to 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 it kind of there's a realization in there that what am I doing in each of the videos that I make, but trying to tell a story in each video, so it's it's a tough exercise, but actually that's probably a good sign. But there's two things. There's like I completely lo lost momentum with work working my way through this book because it's like oh this feels too hard. <sighs> So I need to find a way to kind of work my way through the book, but then say at the end of this book, go, oh, that might be a thing to do is to do a 10 minute story video, uh, you know, once a week, 10 minute story video where I can come up with a couple of ideas for stories, settle on one, make a couple of notes and then go through it. And I think making the notes would help me help me do that. But it's definitely going to be it's definitely going to be an effort, but who knows? Maybe I can actually get something good out of that. So yeah, that is my no ums video. I think it's number 32 after so long. I'm not doing this. I think it's 32. We'll find out what number is listed on this one. All right. I've been Jay.
more videos later.